Welcome to the video, shoulder day today. I almost forgot to record, but I said I was gonna record my shoulder workout next. I already had my pre-workout, pre-workout meal. We're gonna get right into it. Uh, this is my, my shoulder workout. Probably the best shoulder workout you could possibly do. I came up with it myself, put it all together. So I'm gonna get, I'm gonna go pretty, pretty in depth with everything you need to know for this workout. Sets, reps, any anything you need to know so i'll give you the full shoulder workout if you do this workout you'll probably get bigger more defined shoulders my shoulders are definitely improving they were like one of my weakest points definitely the weak point of my upper body but i've been training my shoulders the right way and training them hard and this is helping a lot so it's shoulder day i'm gonna get right into the workout all right, so my recommended supplements to take before a good shoulder workout. This workout especially, because it'll, it'll really get to you. That EVP extreme, you're gonna need the caffeine for this workout. It's gonna help you get that pump. And this workout's pretty intense. So I also recommend taking the Evogen Glycoject. Uh, how you take this, I take my pre-workout 30 minutes before the workout, and then I take this, uh, I fill up my water bottle that I'm gonna drink out of. Now I put a big scoop of this in there. And between every set when I'm resting, my I go 45 seconds, about 45 seconds between each set. I always have at least a sip of my water. And with this in it, what this does is it gives you fast absorbing carbs. It's gonna keep your energy up throughout the workout. And if you have that sip, like my half gallon jug of water, having a, at least a sip or two in between sets, gives you that continuous flow with the fast absorbing carbs. It's gonna get right to you. You're definitely gonna feel the pump and that pump is gonna stay with you. It's gonna give you the best results. It's just something to maximize your, your workout, maximize the pump and the quality of the workout from start to finish. You're not gonna fall off and the pump won't fall off either. It'll just keep coming bigger and bigger. You'll feel a huge pump. If you wanna get this Glycoject by Evogen, or the EVP Extreme by Evogen. Go to evogennutrition.com. You would co use code WEEKSMALLGUY10. You get 10% off and I get a percentage of each sale when my code is used. So gets you a discount, gets you the, the best supplements that you need of the best workout. And I get a little money when you use my code. Links in the description or go to evogennutrition.com. Let's get to the workout. First thing we're gonna do is a superset. Dumbbell overhead press, superset it with rope face pulls. Four sets, the reps are gonna be insane. So for the reps are gonna be the same for each exercise in the superset. Set one, you're gonna do 30 reps on each. So 30 dumbbell presses, you're gonna put the dumbbells down, go over to the face pulls, no rest. 30, because it's a superset, no rest. 30 on the first set. Set number two, 25 reps. Set number three, uh, 20 reps, and set number four, 15 reps. So to give you an idea of the weight, first set, I'm gonna grab the 30s, 30 pound dumbbells for 30. I'm gonna go up 10 pounds each set. So 40 pound dumbbells on set two for 25. Then I go to the 50s for 20 on the third set. And then for the fourth set, I'm gonna do the 60s for 15 reps. Give you an idea of the weight that I use for the rope face pulls. Set number one, I start with uh, 65 pounds and then I add 10 pounds each set. So 65, 75, 85, 95 pounds. Uh, if the cables don't have by fives, you know, you'll be at 100 or 90 or wherever you are. It depends on how strong you are. You're gonna have to figure out the right weight for you. But it's gonna be a struggle to hit 30 on the first. The first set, a struggle to hit 25. Struggle to hit 20, struggle to hit 15. You're gonna have to really push yourself and the high reps are gonna give you a huge pump. Normally I wouldn't do these high reps, but it's gonna shock the muscles and it's gonna start the workout with a huge shoulder pump just after the first super set. Oh, 
Superset number two is going to be front rope cable raises. Supersetted with a dumbbell rear delt flies on the bench, chest supported on the bench. Uh, four sets of 12. So for these, I'm going to focus on I'm lifting it up so that my hands are eye level. I'm trying to hold it for a second, slow and controlled on the way down. 12 reps. Uh, it's all about control. You want to keep your chest up too. That's the key for these chest up nice and slow, lower it with control, hold that pause at the top eye level for a second. Don't go past eye level, you could injure your shoulders if you go too high on these. And then for the uh, dumbbell flies, I'm just trying to pause, just a slight pause. And I don't go all the way down to where they touch, I just go down to where I lose tension. And on those, I'm just doing 12 reps as well. And for these, the key is you, want to, you don't want your shoulder blades to move. You want to lock in position, only move your arms. Your shoulder blades shouldn't move at all on these. Next exercise, there's not going to be any superset, it's just one exercise. Four sets of 12, single arm cable rear delt flies. So with these, you want your elbow slightly bent, but once you get it slightly bent like that, your elbow does not move for the whole movement. It's just slightly bent, it won't move at all. It's in that fixed position. The reason why single arm is so good is because when you stretch your shoulder, you pull it across your chest like this. So you're going to slowly control let it come across and then you're going to maintain that that position you're going to use your rear delt you're going to pull it straight out and hold it to get a really intense contraction of that rear delt it's the best stretch on a shoulder exercise because the shoulder stretches you pull your arm across your body and that cable is going to stretch your arm across your body so this one is key for the stretch and it's great for rear delts Stab me in my back. 
lies It's all you fault that you don't got nobody by your side Yeah, I'm with My final exercise, we saved the best for last Three sets of this and It's gonna be so hard, we're going all out So what I'm gonna do for each set Is I'm gonna do side dumbbell lateral raises And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab the 20 pound dumbbells I'm gonna do 12 and then I'm gonna drop stuff from the 20s to the 15s, 15s for 15, and then I'm gonna go down to the 10s, 10s for 20. So it's three drops, uh, less weight, more reps every drop. And I'm gonna do that three times. So every set is a drop set, and I'm gonna do it three times. So I'm going 20s for 12, 15s for 15, 10s for 20s, rest for about 30 seconds to keep the intensity up, and then do it again three times. That's all finished off with a huge shoulder pump. That's the shoulder workout, pretty insane workout, crazy pump for sure. Uh, even if, if you do this workout, you're definitely gonna get a huge pump. If you take the, uh, the Evo Gym Pre and the Glycoject, you're gonna get like probably the most insane shoulder pump of your life. So get those supplements to evogymnutrition.com, link in bio, or description I should say, link in description, code weaksmallguy10. Get those supplements, support me. You know, it's a win-win. It's a you get the best supplements, I get support, I get a little bit of money, you get a discount and use my code, so make sure you use it. I'm trying to feel a little, a little shredded today. Looked pretty, I thought I looked pretty crazy for sure, so uh, the cut, still going on the cut. We're gonna look insane this summer, that's for sure.